Okay, hi YouTube, Mr. Who's a Boss here, and some pretty good news incoming, I have to say. Two brand new Pokemon games have now been announced, and they're going to be Pokemon Alpha Sapphire and Pokemon Omega Ruby. Now, the whole game is actually going to be remade in 3D, which is just going to be absolutely awesome. So you'll be able to catch the Kyogre Legendary, the Groudon Legendary, as well as the Rayquaza Legendary, and there might also be the Hidden Regis that there were in the original game. So these games are releasing in just November 2014, so pretty much on the doorstep. So here's some footage of the two legendaries, Kyogre and Groudon, which are the sort of primary legendaries obtainable within the game, and they're actually fighting against each other. So this shows some of the moves that will be available, as well as just, you know, how they look in the three-dimensional space, and, you know, I have to say it's pretty epic. So both legendaries also have a base stat of 670, which puts them pretty much at the top of the list in terms of how powerful they are. Pokemon Alpha Sapphire and Pokemon Omega Ruby are also promising to add new game modes to the online experience. I highly doubt they'll be reinventing it this time, but I really do hope, you know, they make some interesting new additions. So the Pokemon company hasn't revealed anything about what they're actually doing in terms of the plot, and what they're doing in terms of additional content. And in both these departments, I really hope they sort of, you know, push themselves. Because, I mean, with Pokemon X and Y, I was really disappointed with how, once you'd beaten the Elite Four and you'd sort of completed the main chunk of the game, there was very little to do. And, I mean, I found these sort of extra missions that you could possibly take up, I found them really, really tedious and boring. One other thing that really annoyed me about Pokemon X and Y, and I want to be fixed in these next few games, is the reduction in frame rate when the 3D is on. And it's not really something you'd expect from Pokemon games, you know, you expect really high levels of polish, but they did lag. And I want this to be sorted in the next two games. You know, you should be able to enjoy the full stereoscopic 3D effect that you've paid for, without having to worry about damaged frame rates. So that's it from me for now, I hope you liked this video, and you know, just tell me what you think, are you really excited about this new Pokemon game? Let us know in the comments below!